Officials in South Africa have been told to expect a visit from the royals later this year and preparations are said to be underway. It has also been suggested Meghan Markle is keen to bring her newborn son Archie along. A source told the Daily Mail, people have been informed that the Duke and Duchess will be coming. Early preparations have begun. This trip will make baby Archie one of the youngest royals to go on an official tour, if they go just months after his May 6th birth. Meghan and Harry are also reportedly considering visiting a number of countries on the continent. Harry has a great fondness of Africa and he revealed to Town & Country last year it is the place where I feel more like myself than anywhere else in the world. Africa has been a retreat for the royal who visited shortly after the death of his mother, Lady Diana. He said to the magazine, My dad told my brother and me to pack our bags, we were going to Africa to get away from it all. After only two dates with Meghan, Harry whisked her off to Botswana to enjoy five nights camping under the stars. The couple returned again the following summer. Meghan's gorgeous engagement ring features a diamond from Botswana at its center. Harry spent a lot of time in Africa before he started a relationship with Meghan as his long-term former girlfriend, Chelsea Davy was born in Zimbabwe and went to the University of Cape Town. As well as a trip to Africa, it is likely Meghan will take her new baby to visit the United States as soon as she can. Meghan Markle's mother, Dory Raglan, has just left England for her home in Louisiana and Meghan reportedly feels that Archie learning about her side of the family is vital. A source told Us Weekly, for Meghan, it's just as important for Archie to learn about her family history as it is for him to learn about his royal ancestors, so she plans to go on a trip to LA with him once she's comfortable taking him on a plane.